Hi students and welcome back to Bank Exams today. And in the previous video, we started for the error spotting based on tenses. And as I promised that I will be bringing the part two. So here is the part two with some more questions based on the tenses. And we are going to do it in details. Uh, basically, I in the previous video I told you to revise all the tenses i hope you all have done that and subject verb agreement as well if you haven't done that yet then i'm again going to share the description in the description box all the links of the previous videos that you so that you can find them easily and revise all the chapters and uh, if you want to ask anything you can mail me i'll be giving you my email id in the last slide so we will start from the example one i came to know that her father has died three days ago no error so we have came it means it is in past to know that her father has died now it is in present uh, so we have to generalize the tense sentence if it is starting from a past tense then we will have to all the other parts of the sentence should be in the past as well so it should be had died uh, second hand you can take from three days ago it means the activity has happened in the past so the sentence should be in the past form so that's why we are using had here right moving to the next example we have when he will find out a solution to this problem he will be awarded a prize now if we have two conditional we have a conditional sentence here when he will find a solution to this problem he will be awarded a prize so this is the condition that the person must find out the solution to his problems to get awarded uh, so that's why the condition should be in present so here it should be when he finds out a solution to this problem he will be awarded a prize in hindi if i say jaise hi ya fir jaise hi wo apne problem ka solution ढूंढ लेता है लाइक इन वी डू करता है करती है करते हैं ऑल दीज वी यूज इन प्रेजेंट इन डेफिनेट सो हेयर द सेम थिंग इज गोइंग टू बी अप्लाइड इट शुड बी इन प्रेजेंट इन डेफिनेट वेन ही फाइंड आउट द सोल्यूशन टू इज दिस प्रॉब्लम ही विल बी अवॉर्डेड अ प्राइस next the sentence is this is the first time that i see such an interesting play now this is the first time that i see such an interesting play the play has ended and the person is speaking about the play which is very interesting so it should be i have seen okay so whenever you are using a sentence which is describing about an activity which has ended and you haven't uh, experienced that and experienced that kind of thing in the past then you should always use perfect tense present perfect tense clear then when she is coming here he brings it should be she here when she is coming here she brings many gifts for me now it is a kind of activity whenever she is coming here she brings many gifts for me it maybe the person is trying to say that his or her mother or sister brings many gifts for him whenever he or she comes so it should be whenever 
she comes here कि वो जब भी यहां पर आती है that is a regular activity or habitual activity it's and we express habitual actions by present indefinite tense so it should be whenever she comes here she brings many gifts for me then now a days she teaches english because of the teacher of english has gone for a month's leave no error uh now a days she teaches english wo english padhati hai this is i don't think this is right because the teacher of english has gone for a month's leave the teacher is teaching english wo padha rahi hai because the other teacher has taken a leave so now a days she is teaching english because this is a very short term activity whenever the other teacher will come back the substitute teacher will be replaced to other side right so that's why she is teaching english next it is high time you are starting this new business said suresh to mahesh now if we read the sentence it is a narration direct it is high time you are starting this new business it should be it is high time you started this new business because the business has been started the uh, from the this thing we can realize that the business has already been started by mahesh so it should be you started this new business while doing error spotting you should read the sentence carefully because a small hint or small ignorance can lead to and to get the marks deducted do read the sentences carefully even it is a small sentence you have to read it two or three times to find out the exact error sometimes we find out something which doesn't have error but you think that there is an error so try to read sentence two or three times so that you can find the actual error okay next moving to the next sentence i'll let you know as soon as i will get any information in this regard i will let you know main tumhe bataunga as soon as i will get any information in this regard if you speak this sentence in hindi it will be like main tumhe bataunga jaise hi mujhe koi information milti hai now milti hai or any sentence that ends with ta te or ti is related to present indefinite right so it should be i get any information in this regard if you are not able to find out the error try to speak the sentence or try to think about the sentence how you will speak the sentence in hindi and then read try to translate the sentence in proper tense and you will find the error easily next when i will cross 50 my husband will cross 45 again we have a conditional sentence that we have done earlier so it should be when i cross 50 jaise hi main 50 ke paar ho jaungi my husband will cross 45 right next the secret of her good health lies in the fact that she is getting up early and goes to bed now very easy sentence we have a habitual activity he go she goes to bed it means it, it is present indefinite the secret of her good life is 
in the fact that she gets up early gets up represents her daily activity habit okay so it should be in present indefinite tense next we have students sitting on the dais studied here for 3 years but they have never created any problem now we are talking about students who have completed their study from the college or school so the activity has been accomplished it should be in past perfect present perfect right the students sitting on the dais have studied here or had studied for 3 years but they have never created any problem because they have is used that's why we are using have studied right the students sitting on the dais have studied here wo yahan par padh chuke hain for 3 years 3 saal tak but they never have created any problem he is living in this house since 1983 we have discussed this many times that if you are given a time definite or indefinite time then you must use present perfect continuous past perfect continuous tense now the person is living in that house from since 1983 so we will use present perfect continuous tense and this will be he has been living in this house since 1983 next we have it is appearing to me that you are trying to destabilize the present committee clearly we know that the error, error is in a first tense because it is appearing to me if you speak it in hindi it will be like mujhe lagta hai and as i told you ta te ti these sentences are always in present indefinite so it will be it appears to me that you are trying to destabilize the present committee it is not like mujhe ye lag raha hai aapko ye lagta hai i have been knowing him for many years but i don't know where he works now you will be uh, thinking about that for many years is the indefinite time period given in this sentence but i don't know where he works but if you read the sentence main usse janta hu bahut saalon se you don't say main usse jaan rahi hu ya jaan raha hu that activity is not perfect continuous right so main usse जानता हूं या फिर जान चुका हूं आई हैव नोन हिम फॉर मैनी ईयर्स इफ इफ देर वॉज नो मैनी ईयर्स देन यू शुड राइट इट एज आई नो हिम बट आई डोंट नो वेयर ही वर्क बट इफ यू आर गिवन फॉर मैनी ईयर्स यू शुड बी यूजिंग I have known him for many years. Right? Next, if she would have done this, she would have done wrong and would have deceived many of her relatives. And the last is no error. Now we have a condition here if she would have done this she would have done wrong now we are this is the condition it should be like if she had done this 
बिकॉज अगर उसने ये किया है या वो ये कर चुकी है शी वुड हैव डन रॉन्ग उसने गलती की है एंड वुड हैव डिसीव्ड मैनी ऑफ अर रिलेटिव राइट सो द कंडीशन शुड ऑलवेज बी इन पास्ट और प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस द विक्टिम ट्राइड टू टेल अस वट हैज हैपन बट इज वर्ड वर नॉट ऑडिबल the word sentence is starting from past ending from past but we have a has in the middle so it should be had what had happened clear very easy sentences i have picked up for you we will be moving to a difficult ones slowly i want you all to just imbibe in you yourself all the basic things so that we can move to the difficult sentences easily and you don't need to revise all the rules and tricks again and again once you are once you have learned all the details from the very basics it will be easier for you to move to the difficult sentences that's why we are using the step by step strategy for you all so that you can learn everything from the very basics because people are uh, we i get the mails from uh they say that they are very weak in english so i want you uh, these videos are made for them i want them to know the basics of english grammar from the de- from every detail and so that they can <clears throat> overcome their difficulty in exams and i hope i have tried my best in this video as well moving to the next sentence i want you to pick up the box of chocolates gently and kept it in the corner carefully now the sentence is starting from present and ending from past so it should be in present only i want you to pick up the box of chocolates gently and keep it in the corner carefully it should be keep right next she came to the party much later than i expect she came to the party wo party mein aayi but bahut late hai jitna maine socha tha tha means past but the sentence is ending from first form it should be in past as well so it should be expected she came to the party much later than i had expected jitna maine socha tha ya main soch chuka tha next i lived here for 5 years so i know about the problems of this area it should be like i had been so i know about the problems of this area it is present it should be like i have been living here for 5 years for 5 years so i know about the problems of this area the last sentence says the chairperson has had not taken any decision until she had studied the case thoroughly no error the chairperson had not taken usne nahi liya it means the decision was not taken by the chairperson uh, until she read all the details thoroughly so it should be like the chairperson did not take because after reading the case she had taken the <coughs> decision so it was for the short while that she did not take any decision and we will replace the had not with did not take if you are new to the tenses then you should remember that if you are using did then you should always use first form of verb right and you are if you are using has have had then you should always use third form of verb 
if has have and had comes with been then you should use verbs first form plus ing now we have done 20 examples in this video and i hope that i tried my best to make sure that the each sentence is explained in detail and if you find any problem with this video do comment in the comment box and you want to me to reply to your queries just email me at ydv28 insia at the rate gmail.com I will be replying to your queries uh, within one day because I'm, I keep myself very busy with other stuff as well and don't forget to download the GK Digest Android application we will be providing you the link in the description section and subscribe the channel so that you can get all the videos and information and don't forget to hit the like bell button to get the notifications of our live videos and sessions thanks for watching this video i hope you like that keep supporting tank exams today